Hey, this is Dr. Tori with RookieDoctor.com. I want you to think for a second. I'm going to attempt to draw somebody here that's that's uh, thinking a little bit. Actually, this person might look a little angry. But just think for a moment of what learning is like when you're in training right now. So there's the setting of being on rounds with, you know, some attending, s sitting there, and um, other people around, interns, re med students, residents, all uh, all around talking uh, about patient care, right? There's that setting. And then there's also the setting of usually an attending, uh, sometimes a resident doing a presentation of some sort, um, and uh, everybody's in the audience. Uh, learning uh, or participating in some way right so these are the these are the different sort of settings on rounds and um, in conferences where you're learning right but what's different about this than uh, in meaning about these two settings than from say while you're in actual medical school classes or in college classes or learning some other material what's different is this notes taking notes that's what's different notes are missing we tend not to take notes on rounds for sure uh, because that you know you're so freaked out about whether you're gonna be called on or not so you tend not to ask you, you tend not to be taking notes at that time um, occasionally you might fake it like you're about to write something down just for the sake of avoiding eye contact we all know that strategy but most people are not taking copious notes during that time the other thing is, during say a conference in uh, you know in the middle of your day during your residency training, it also seems like uh, most people are not taking notes at that time, and um, you know some people are looking at their beeper and then walking out. Some people are sort of looking at it like it's a time to relax. Some people are sitting there tapping their foot, completely stressed because they still have to go finish their notes. Okay, but most people are not taking notes, and that's what's missing. So what do you do about that? What do you do about the fact that notes are missing? Maybe there's an alternative, okay? And I'm actually demoing that alternative right now. And here's what's awesome about it. What I'm showing you right now is called the LiveScribe pen, okay? And um, you can get to it by going to rookiedoctor.com slash amazing pen, okay? Or you can just search for it on Amazon. And uh, by the way, if you use my link, it's possible that I could earn a commission, just FYI. So, uh, but I'm recommending it because it's completely awesome, not because I earn a commission. Uh, but I wanted to be transparent with you. So anyway, you take this live scribe pen and you go to any one of these settings, your uh, conferences or rounds, okay? And it's either, you know, let's, let's just say, for example, you start taking notes. Now, let's, let me show you what you can do with these notes. Let's say you take notes, okay? You take notes during the actual conference or rounds, but when you come back to those notes, those notes are clickable and they can actually broadcast sound and have recorded the entire thing. So that if you click on one, one portion of the notes, it will bring you right back to the audio of what was being said at the moment that you were writing that down. Now imagine the power of that. Imagine the power of notes that you could come back to and actually hear what they're talking about. So you could draw cute pictures like this instead of long copious lists and bullets and things like that that are difficult to wade through. But if you draw things as you go, boy, imagine the power there. So anyway, not only can you have the audio, but that audio can become a video of you actually writing these things out okay so I'm going to demo how this works in a moment okay so now check this out here's what we have we are at the notes the notes that I just took right before your eyes as I was speaking however what's different about these notes is that I actually recorded myself while I was taking these notes so that if I click on any particular portion
If I click on another portion, you So do you realize what just happened? I took notes onto this paper, and the pen can now go back and click and hear that portion of the audio wherever I am clicking, okay? So that I can have pictures, diagrams, etc., thoughts, random thoughts, pieces of words, titles, whatever you want, and this, this piece right here, the note, can become the audio. And then what happens is all I have to do is dock it you dock it into your computer and it will upload it into your computer and then become this video so this is com this is completely awesome now imagine you're not there for a few days you're not there on rounds somebody else borrows your pen you come back you can learn all the lessons that they had learned while they were taking notes because you can just click on their notebook now how sweet is that so this is called the live scribe pen you can go to amazon and search for it or you go to rookiedoctor.com slash amazing pen it'll forward you right to it so go check it out because this tool is amazing it is the secret weapon of learning the secret weapon